Welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to stop apps or programs from running automatically when you start up your Mac or MacBook. You might want to know how to do this in order to make your Mac quicker to start up or to speed it up in general. If there are multiple users on your device, then you can change the apps that run at startup separately for each user. The method is nice and simple, so it shouldn't take us too long. Remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe if the video helps. Let's get into the method. To stop apps from starting automatically when you start your Mac or MacBook, first go to System Preferences. You can get there by clicking on the Apple icon in the top left, and then by choosing System Preferences from the list. Within System Preferences, click on Users and Groups. It should be somewhere on the second row. In here, choose your profile from the list on the left. Now go to the Login Items tab, it will probably be next to the Password tab. You should now be able to see the list of applications that will run automatically when you start your Mac or MacBook. To stop a program from running at startup, select it in here by clicking on it once, and then click on the minus icon. You can always add it again in the future by clicking on the plus icon, and then navigating to where it is stored on your Mac. This will likely be the Applications folder. And so that is how to stop apps or programs from running automatically when you start up your Mac or MacBook. Click the card on screen now to watch a video of mine showing you 10 easy ways you can speed up your macOS device. We've already completed one of those methods in today's video, so it won't take very long. Help support the channel by visiting the store, the link is in the description and at the end of the video. If you have any questions, then let me know in the comments below, and if you did find today's video helpful, remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe for more tips in the future. Be sure to stick around to see some of my other videos that you might be interested in. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in another video.